Hey, so today I'll be taking a quick look at a game called Mega Rats. I'm just going to read the description real quick. It says, Defend the city and save Earth. Showcasing some of the latest capabilities from Red Frisbee Studios, Mega Rats is a fun-filled and carefully crafted mix of fluid physical motion and breathtaking 3D stylized photorealistic graphics. Alright, so this is more or less a technical test in my opinion. It's not really a full game. Although, it didn't mention this, but this game also has VR capabilities, so if you have a VR headset, um, you can experience it in VR, which might be a pretty cool experience. Um, but other than that, it's more or less a physics-based game. I can actually fall, my character can fall, and uh, he can do a variety of like physics-based motions like kicking, kind of a weird kicking animation. <laughs> I could do this crazy skipping uh, little thing if I keep pressing the kick button. And same with the other leg too, kind of odd. Uh, I can also fall down, um, let's see if I can showcase that. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> Alright, I didn't know, but apparently holding shift? Wait, I don't even know how I did that. Oh, whoa, okay. So holding shift and spacebar at the same time activates some sort of crazy turbo boost, which allows me to like fly across the screen. And now I'm walking on nothing. Um, hmm. Alright, so maybe this game has a, a fair share of glitches. There's also enemies. I think there's an enemy here. This game is called Mega Rats, so um, I think it was trying to be a first person shooter where you shoot a variety of uh, different rats. And it's kind of weird. Oh, there we go. I was gonna say, it's kind of weird because the first time I played this, I was like falling down all the time. Um, so you can just like fall down randomly. Whoa! Some enemies just spawned. Let's see if they can hit me. Yep. If they hit me, I fall over. And then I just get back up. It kind of reminds me of Overgrowth, if anyone's ever played that game. Um, Alright. Let's go ahead and shoot these rats. I don't know if you can kill them. You kind of just shoot them and they fall over and they get back up. Oh, it looks like that one. Um, uh oh. I do not know how to reload. There we go. Whoa, I'm like going underneath the ground. This game is filled with a lot of bugs. Level 0 experiment experience 10 out of 100. Collected coin. Uh, as you can tell, a lot of the menus are seem to be like 3D text in midair. And I, I'm pretty sure that this game was intended to be a VR game. And then I guess they converted it. Um, but I'm just assuming that, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, I also have a jetpack. If I hold the spacebar, I can kind of fly for a little while, and then it'll stop after a short distance, and then I'll fall back down. And what just happened to my body? <laughs> Did I die? Oh, no, I didn't die. What is this? Just garbage? Floating garbage? It's kind of cool. It, it, it's kind of like I'm in some sort of like low-gravity um, world. Whoa, I just fell, uh-oh, I fell through the, through the map. Hopefully I can get back up, there we go. <laughs> I gotta just go through the map. Um, normally you start, oh, here, let me fly up a little. Normally you start over there. Um, there's multiple different cities, but I, um, whenever I was just trying this game out, uh, I saw that there was this huge strip of just buildings over here, so I decided to come over here. But let's go ahead and go back and see if we can't find anything. Let's go ahead and activate, like, the turbo boost or whatever it is. Whoa! I think it's a mix between, like, jetpack and going forward, and that's what, like, slingshots you for. <laughs> Pretty sure that's a bug, um, but it does help me get across the map a little bit easier. So here's another city. There's a variety of these, uh, like, collectible things all over the place, these little coins. I think these are experience, although I could be mistaken on that. Um, but it does, it really does not seem like a finished game. They probably should have released this game in early access, although it still might um, come out in early access. I'm not entirely sure. It doesn't say anywhere that um, it's going to launch in early access. I did get this game a day early, so I'm not entirely sure on that. Um, what is this? Okay, so here's another like VR menu. So you can change your settings on the uh, on the billboard, which is kind of cool. But I mean, the only thing you can really do in this game besides fly around is uh, workshop is kill the rats. At least from what I've seen, I could 
try to go in a building. I highly doubt you can go in a building. Yeah, no, you can't. There's some more cities over there. I guess we'll just go that way. Zoom! <laughs> it's, it's pretty fun to just fly super fast. Alright. Here's some more coins. They look like bitcoins. So normally you spawn right here when you first get the game. And for some reason it says... Collected red coin in the 0 to 4. Um, when I first played this game, it said Steam Inventory on this truck, but it's not there anymore. So I'm collecting those Bitcoins. Maybe there's a shop somewhere? I don't know. I guess we'll just have to explore a little bit longer. Counting in taxes? We will do it for you. It has a pretty good soundtrack though, surprisingly. I mean, the one good thing I would give it is the soundtrack is pretty good. It does say it has stylized photorealistic graphics. I'm not entirely sure what they mean by that. I'm guessing the textures were made by using photos, but the game certainly doesn't look photorealistic by any means. Um, but the cities do look nice and they're well detailed. And I think these things are supposed to be giant rats. You can, you can hardly tell sometimes. Wait, who's that guy? What the heck? They're just walking? <laughs> well, they're gone. The map is huge as well. Okay, let's see if we can... What the... Hello? Oh, he just knocked me over? For some reason, I can't... I can't fly anymore. That's weird. I can't use my jetpack. Maybe I ran out of energy? From the looks of things, it seems like pretty much every city is more or less the same and what you can find, just some rat people, and it looks like there's a like an air blimp over here. I could try to get to it, although I don't think I'll be able to jump that high without the jetpack. I can try using the jetpack one more time. Oh wait, there we go. Oh, almost. Let's see if we can't... Yeah, that's... Come on. Go, go. There we go. We're gonna jump on top of this building first, and then we're gonna try to launch ourselves up onto the hot air balloon. And there's a day and night cycle as well. Okay, fly, fly, fly! Aw, oh, what? That's weird. There we go. Oh, what? <laughs> it, I guess you can only fly a certain distance up in the air. It's not letting me go that high. Oh well. Oh. Have you found any elements you know, like helium? They can be useful. Okay. Commander Hendrix, hello? Yeah, this definitely does not feel like a finished game. I'm hoping that it releases in early access. If it's already released and it's in early access, uh, I'm sorry about this video, but... Uh, I got it a little early, so I'm not really sure what to expect here. Um, demonstrating the latest capabilities of Red Frisbee Studios. It seems just like a like a a test, like an alpha test for a game. I mean, there could be something here. I mean, they could be developing something more. But as it stands, I would not really consider this to be a full game. Because um, all you can really do is explore, you can shoot some uh, rat people, and all these cities look more or less the same. Right, there's another rat person. I mean, it is called Mega Rats, so... Oh, I just blew up that. Awesome. It is called Mega Rats, and it does say you're supposed to, like save the earth and defend the city, so maybe once this game gets fleshed out more it'd be kind of fun. Let's see what's over here. Probably nothing. I can only fly up a certain distance, so let's try going around. Yeah, just another, just more cities. 
And you can actually run underwater. There's no swimming. Slingshot across. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, I think I'm gonna end this video. Oh, wait. Oh my god, I keep rolling down. I can't get out of here. Ah! Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Yes, yes! You can only fly forward a, a short distance. It doesn't let you slingshot across the entire map. And what is going on with these rats? <laughs> and I just got shot by one of them. <laughs> He's having a hard time getting up. But yeah, I think I'm gonna end this video here. Just a quick little demonstration, I guess, of Mega Rats. This game releases on Steam um, in about 18 hours or tomorrow. Um, so yeah, just, I guess, thanks for watching. If you want to check out this game yourself, I'll put a link in the description below to the Steam store page. And uh, again, thanks for watching. Have a nice day.